Do you trust the NHS to keep your medical records confidential? That goes to the heart of this issue. The plan to collect and share medical data from GPs affects everyone whose family doctor is in England. Due to begin in weeks, it's been delayed till the autumn. We listened to patients and the public who told us over the last few weeks that they needed more time to uh, be able to understand the benefits of this really important data sharing initiative in the NHS. And in particular, we listened to GPs. The Care Data Scheme involves your medical records and mine being uploaded to a central database. The information will be largely anonymised, so your name and address will be removed. It will allow researchers to monitor drug treatment and compare health outcomes across England. Patients can opt out of sharing their medical records by contacting their GP, but public awareness is, to put it mildly, low. Do you know about this scheme to share GP patient records? Have you heard about it? No, not at all. Not heard of it. Sorry. Unfortunately, they, I don't think the government have got a very, got a very, very, very good record for uh, computerisation, unfortunately. But I think if you do get it off the ground, I think it could work. The NHS has been collecting hospital data for decades to good effect. It allows death rates to be compared and helped reveal scandals like mid-staffs. NHS England says this anonymised information has never been breached, but privacy campaigners remain unconvinced. The NHS England team needs to do much more to ensure patients know what their choices are and that the risks involved in this scheme to their privacy are very real. Cancer charities and medical researchers say sharing GP records will complete the jigsaw of patient care, driving up standards. NHS England has till the autumn to convince the public. Fergus Walsh, BBC News.